What was that noise? What's up, everybody? This is Heaven Stark Phoenix, and I'm back with WWE 2K19 this year. And we're going to start Chapter 1, Van Going to the Big Time. So let's get, thing get things started. Yeah, so I just completed uh, 2K18. It's kind of underwhelming. So I'm hoping that this one will be a lot better with the voice acting and... Um, yeah, that's basically the big thing that I'm, I've noticed. Hey, big BCW show this Friday night at the high school. Tell your friends. Don't need a flyer. I go to every show. Wait, is that you? Um, what do you mean? Facing Mr. CQ in the main event. It's definitely you. Uh, <laughs> I guess I can... See the resemblance, but that guy's a huge indie star. Why would he be out here flying for a show? Hey, is this weirdo bothering you? He's one of the wrestlers. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. Have fun at the show. Yo, I thought wrestlers had money. Why would he be driving around some crappy bug bait? See, see, good point. More proof that I am not who you think I am. Sure. You gotta check out this guy's highlights online. He's going to be a huge star in WWE someday. <laughs> Thanks. That's, That's nice, nice of you to say. say. I mean, about the wrestler, the wrestler on the poster, poster who's, um, definitely not me. Come on, let's go. Smooth. Hope you beat Mr. Mr. CQ. CQ. I can't, I can't stand, stand that guy. Oh, well, maybe I'll see you in the crowd Friday night. I mean, he's a fan. As a fan. Uh, definitely not from the ring. Because I'm not a wrestler. <laughs> what was the big deal? How come he wasn't proud to be a wrestler? That's kind of weird. <laughs> Or is it just the fact that he doesn't want people to know that he's broke? <laughs> A few days later. Bugs be gone. Yo, I'm broke as hell. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. It's, it's showtime. <laughs> to meet Matt Bloom from NXT. Matt, this is my protege, Van Gogh. I'm a big fan, Mr. Bloom. I've studied all your matches from your run in WWE and Japan. Really great stuff. Thanks. You must be a true student of the game. I try to be. So why do they call you Van Gogh? Are you some kind of artist? <laughs> Boy, I gave him that name because everywhere he goes, his dad's old work van goes. He practically lives in that thing. Yeah, practically. So what brings you out to our show? I'm here to scout your opponent, Cole Quinn. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know who Cole is, but we're gonna give him we're gonna give him some props. Cole's, Cole's great. great. You won't, you be, won't disappointed. be disappointed. I'll have my eye on you as well. Wait, really? really? You're, You're rustling, rustling Cole. Cole. So, so it'll be kinda hard, hard not, not to. to. Yeah, 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 yeah good, good point. point. Well, I should well, go, I should go get, get ready. ready. It was nice, it was nice meeting you, Mr. Bloom, Bloom, and thanks, thanks for coming out to the show. Man, good to see you. That, 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 that roll, Greeny. Tonight's my big chance to get signed to NXT. So don't do anything to screw it up. <laughs> okay, look. I'm gonna give it everything I have tonight, and we'll see where we stand after that. All I know is I'll be standing in Orlando at the Performance Center. You can continue standing in high school gyms. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> So he's our, our rival. <laughs> yeah, fuck Cole. Let's go, let's go to the match.
I hope they actually do a career mode that continues. So like after this game is over, they continue the story or they do something like Generations. Like we go back to the Golden Age where we're fighting Hogan, Flair, Ultimate Warrior, Andre the Giant. Oh, here we go. Sort of like a legacy sort of thing is what I was getting at. From Albuquerque, New Mexico, weighing in at an astonishing 206 pounds, the assassin, Ricky Matthews. And from the bottomless pits of his grandfather's asshole, Cole! <laughs> that outfit. <laughs> I, I mean, that, that pretty much sums it up right there. <laughs> Is this outfit. <laughs> Some BCW action about to come up with Ricky versus Cole. The greatest of all time versus greatest of whatever he. Yeah. Greatest of fashion, I suppose. This guy's real pleased with himself. <laughs> So I detect some booze out there. People are digging this guy. Not exactly what I was expecting, but okay. All right, we're on the indie scene. Let's take him down. Whoa! Uh-uh. Let's try that again. <clears throat> yeah, that's right. Somebody call the principal because these two are breaking all the rules. <laughs> the principal. <laughs> Yep. Boom. Let's go, Cole. Let's go. Oh shit, my stamina is already on the potential to go all night. Wow. They don't because per the school principal, we have a strict 11 p.m. curfew. <laughs> my stamina is horrible right now. Take him down. Someday we'll be able to afford play-by-play -play announcers. Until then, you're stuck with me, Baron Blade. <laughs> Baron Blade. If you don't know who Baron Blade is, he's in every single video game. He was your rival in 2K15. He was a nobody in 2K17. And in 2K18, he was your NXT uh, handler. And I guess now he's he's aged quite a bit, and that's what I mean by generations, like like the continuation. No fancy stage, no flashy pyro, no one running their mouth for way too long. Well, except for me. Other than that, it's all action, all the time, and these guys are two of the best. Okay, Baron, chill. But what I was saying, though, is that in Generations, you can have somebody in the golden age of wrestling 
and then they can retire, and then you make a new character who's like the like the, the family member of that character that won the title. You know, just kind of have some sort of legacy thing that, that would add to the story. That would be pretty dope. This is the most exciting thing to take place at this gym since last week's pep rally. Ooh, getting a little tired here. I'm gonna let the action speak for itself for a second. Tonight's attendance is oh never mind. Just enjoy the match, everyone. Let me see if I could actually have some distance. Oh, did I? It doesn't even seem like I hit him. There's so much at stake in this match. Let's just say you never know who's watching at a BCW show. Yo, Cole sucks, man. Okay, I got this. I got my signature now. Boom! Crazy ass neck breaker. All right, let's go ahead and finish this fool off. Is he all right? Yep, here we go. Second, whoever has a red pickup truck with a license plate, OCS 732, you're blocking the school nurse's car and she'd like to go home now. <laughs> all right, Baron. Count it. In the middle of the ring, Cole, you're done. And the contract has been claimed on Cole, whatever the hell his name is. Alright, our first victory, not bad. Hopefully this year will be more successful than the previous 2K games that have suddenly crashed on me uh, when I get close to the championship. So here's hoping that uh, WWE 2K19 will have a good My Career mode. Good match, good match Van Gogh. Yeah, yeah, great, great job, job out there. there. It means a lot it's coming from you. Orlando, here I come. I'm going to get a condo on the beach. There's no, There's no beach, beach in Orlando. Orlando. Well, well, then I'll make then I'll sure, sure to furnish my condo with wall-to-wall -to -wall sand. sand. Before, you, Before start you start making big plans, plans we have a few, few things, things to discuss. discuss. Like what? My start, my start date? date? Future, Future opponents? opponents. Waste, waste measurements, measurements for the for NXT, NXT title? title. You believe exactly. this guy. To be honest, I'm not a fan of your Mr. CQ character. You need to come up with something different. It's not really a character, but fine. I can, I can come up with something different. This is who he is on the outside. <laughs> Full disclosure, I don't think you'll be heading to NXT. Not anytime soon, at least. You're just not ready. I was actually more impressed with your opponent over here. Wait, what? So I've decided to offer him an opportunity instead. You'll have a tryout match in an up-and-coming WWE event. Damn, shot down. I've been doing this a while now, and I know talent is some kind of joke. Because you were supposed to be here to scout me and not him. Plans change, Plans change all, all the time, time in this business. business. That's, That's a, good a good lesson for you to learn. learn. I have to go have catch to go my flight. flight. You and you Baron will be here from us soon with the, with the details, details on your tryout match. match. Don't, Don't make, make me regret, regret my decision. decision. I, won't. I won't. Thank, Thank you. you. Unbelievable. I told you not to ruin this for me, and look what happened. Whoa, all I did was give it everything I had out there, okay? I can't help it that he saw more potential in me. Potential? Or was, or was it your boy, boy Barry, Barry here putting you over with him? With him. I, always I always knew that he was your favorite, favorite but I didn't but think it would cost me a shot at, at WWE. WWE. This, was this was all Matt Bloom's decision. decision. Do you think, you think I want to see my top guys, guys leave? <laughs> and do you think do you we want to stay, stay here forever, forever wrestling in front of a few hundred people for craft money? That's not what I meant. I'm just saying we're building something good here. Besides, if you left, who would design our title belts? I only, I only make your belts because, because you pay us so little for wrestling. wrestling. It's, so it's so bad, bad. Teacher's, teacher's pet over here has, has to live in his van. van. I thought that, I thought was, that was a joke. joke. I only I live in it when times are tough, tough. Which, is which is most of the most time. Of the time.
Well, that nickname's not as much fun anymore. Look, you just need to trust the process. We're building a brand. And think of it this way. If any of us make it to WWE, it'll be good for everyone. It'll help put BCW on the map and lead to more opportunities. Oh, yeah. Easy for you to say. You're the one with a WWE tryout match. He's right, though. What's the saying? A rising boat will lift all tides? I think it's the other way around. Whatever. Come on, let's drop this thing and bring it in for a BCW handshake. Yeah, no thanks. I'll let you two celebrate alone. Damn, salty much. Don't worry about him. And congrats! I'm truly happy for you! So, Baron's pretty cool now. Uh, he used to be a dick, but I guess he's kind of mellowed out. Considering that he's retired and fat, and a promoter. This is way bigger than the high school gym. And the VFW. And the state fair. Combined. Don't let that bother you. All that matters is the rings the same size. All right, All right, good point, good point but, but I assume their, their rings, rings aren't covered in rust and, and mysterious stains. stains. Hey, we're working, working on fixing on that. that. Come, Come on, on, let's go meet Triple H, H and, uh, and uh, try to play it cool. You don't, you don't want to recite his entire career, career history, history like you did, did with, with Matt Bloom. Bloom. <laughs> <sighs> it wasn't his entire career history. Hey, Hunter, it's been a while. This is my guy that Matt Bloom wanted to bring in for the tryout match tonight. Nice, nice to meet, to meet you. you. You trained him, Baron? Baron? I did. He's one of, one of my top, top students. students. I'll, try I'll try not to not hold that against him. him. Look, I've heard a lot of good things, but I want to see you in action tonight before we decide anything. Do you have an opponent for him yet? I do. Surviving in WWE is all about how you handle adversity, so you're going to face the toughest guy we have. Actually, the toughest monster we have. Go introduce, Go introduce yourself, yourself to Braun. Braun. Don't, Don't worry. worry. He, won't he won't hurt you. Hurt you. Not until you match, match, at least. At least. Alright then. Uh, uh, hey, hey, Braun? Braun? I, 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 just I just wanted to introduce want to myself. myself. No, no autographs. autographs. I'm, I'm not a I'm not fan. fan. I'm, I'm actually, actually your opponent, opponent tonight. tonight. You mean victim? victim? So how, so how do you want to die tonight? Uh, Damn. I'd like to survive tonight, if that's okay with you. What I meant was, in what type of match do you want to get these hands? The... Probably doesn't matter. Let's have a false count anywhere match. I've won a bunch of those on the indies, so I like my chances. I can't believe you thought I was actually going to let you choose your type of match tonight. Yep. We're going to do what I want to do, because I'm the monster among men. So it'll be a steel cage match. That way you can't run from me. Steel cage. Great idea. That was my second choice. If it seems kind of out of place with the music, or just like the sounds in general, it's because I disabled all the sounds and music so that I don't get copyrighted. So, if it seems a little off, that's the reason. But it looks like we got some stuff. Huzzah! So we're gonna go ahead and skip my intro, and let's watch uh, Braun Strowman's.
They did a good job with doing his uh, his intro. Hey, I didn't sign up for a cage match. Unlock the thing. Hey, freak show. <laughs> Spider-Man. <laughs> oh, fuck. This isn't going very well. What? <laughs> oh, come on. Look at my health. Oh, come on! Were we just talking about his entrance like not too long ago? <laughs> oh, that sucks. I didn't get one hit on this this guy, man. I was hoping to get at least one hit. job out there. Really? Feels like I got run over by a big bearded tank. Think it was enough for him to sign me? I don't know. But no matter what, you always have a home in the BCW. Thanks. Hey, I saw a lot of positive things from you tonight. Most importantly, you didn't seem intimidated by being on the bigger stage or by being locked in the cage with a monster. So with that being said, we'd like to offer you an NXT contract. Look that over and return it at tomorrow night's show. This is amazing. Thank you. I would shake your hand, but I think three of my fingers are dislocated. Don't worry about it. Rest up and we'll finalize everything tomorrow night. I like dislocate some fingers. I'm shocked. We got power slammed. Me too. I just can't believe it. I mean, against all odds. I know. I'll definitely be sad to see you go. You've become one of my top guys. You'll be fine though, right? I mean, you got Cole and the rest of the crew, yeah? Sorry. What, what am I doing? This is your time to celebrate, not to worry about me and BCW. You enjoy the moment. I'm gonna go talk to Triple H about when you might start, so maybe I can get you on one more BCW show. We'll do a big farewell match. It'll be great. Sounds good. I... I'll see you back at the hotel. Congrats. I'm... I'm proud of you. Thanks, Baron. Couldn't have done it without you. Wow. He's not a selfish prick anymore. Was oh. tonight just a one-time thing? Are you signing with WWE? Well, actually, I was literally just offered an NXT contract, and I can't wait to get started. You should just skip NXT and go straight to the main roster. Actually, you know what? Hey, Triple H, you say listen to your audience? Well, the audience is saying that I'm good enough to go straight to the main roster, which actually, I think I proved it tonight by going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down. Yeah, that's bad. Oh. <laughs> Got jumped on his first night. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to be doing a giveaway for my Funko Pop uh, Ric Flair. If you want one of that, just go ahead and uh, want in on that. Just uh, hit the like button for this video. Uh, subscribe if you enjoyed what I've offered. Um, there's going to be future videos coming up, future stuff planned, uh, depending on how much time I have to work on my YouTube channel. I don't do this for money, so I just do this for fun. So, uh, um, yeah. Um, but yeah, I have things planned for that Funko Pop. Uh, we're probably gonna go ahead and uh, tonight by going toe to toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down. But less than 24 hours. After we offer you the opportunity of a lifetime, you get into a fight with a fan outside a WWE event, and there's video. I'd really love to hear this explanation. Well, 
I have nothing. I've, I've got nothing. The fan attacked me first. I apologize. Let's go with this one. Fan attacked me first. I was just defending myself. What am I supposed to do? Defending? You just got my ass kicked. All we can see is you fighting with a member of the WWE universe, and that's not good. Well, that's how it happened. You need to understand, this isn't some rinky-dink independent promotion running shows at the Elks Lodge. This is a publicly traded global company. We can't have our WWE superstars getting into fights with fans, and it will not be tolerated. On top of that, you were bashing NXT, saying you were going straight to the main roster. Who in the hell do you think you are? I was just having fun with the fans. I was just about to say that I would be happy to go to NXT, and the fan attacked me. Oh, I bet. This is what I get for trying to do business with one of your guys, Baron. Come on, Hunter. Can't you just find him or something? No, because I can't find him if he's not on the active roster. I'm rescinding the contract offer. Leave the building or I will have security escort you out. Don't I'm really short. Bring me one of, one of his guys, guys again. again. This, is this is on YouTube. YouTube. Understood. Understood. Remember, Remember what I said about making me regret, regret my decision? My decision? Congratulations. Congratulations. You did, you did it, it in record, record time. time. And on top of that, I am the shortest guy in the room. Oh. Hey, hey, this wasn't, this your, wasn't your, fault. your fault. I'm sure, I'm we'll, sure figure we'll figure out something, out something else. else. Now, yeah, come, on, come on, grab your grab stuff. Your stuff. We, gotta we gotta go. go. Don't worry, kid. We'll get him next time. Just a minute. Wakey, wakey, Jake, Jake the, the Snakey. snakey. Oh, it is too it's early for that to be funny. funny. Sorry, Sorry, I couldn't, I couldn't wait, wait to tell you the good news. news. Triple H called, called and wants to offer me a contract again? again? No. no. Yeah. <laughs> What could be better than that? Well, after news of your NXT contract being pulled hit the internet, your fan fight video went viral. It's over 2 million views now. Sorry, make that 2.2 million. So a whole lot of people have watched me throw my career away. Why is that a good thing? Because controversy creates cash. My phone's been blowing up. Everyone wants to book you now. You're the hottest thing on the indie scene. And based upon the principle of supply, there's only one of you. And demand, like I said, is high. Your rate is skyrocketing. Okay, okay, this could be good. It could be very good. We could turn chicken crap into chicken salad, if you know what I'm saying. Not really. I don't think I get it. You're going to stick it to Triple H and WWE by making your own success in the indies. You'll be way bigger than you ever would have been at NXT or WWE, and we'll do it together. So what do you say? Are you in? I mean, what other choice do I have? I'm in. I'm in. All right. Now, go brush your teeth. Your breath is terrible. It's too early for this. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Cool. Got some new rewards for getting my ass kicked by Braun Strowman. A lot of load times in this game. Somebody you want to explain to me what's going on here? Give me a minute. Welcome to the new reality of BCW. Because of all your online hype, we sold out our usual allotment of tickets a few days ago. But since I'm an entrepreneurial genius, I pulled some strings with the school principal, allowing us to move the show outside. Therefore, doubling our capacity. <laughs> All right, all right, good work. But that's not all. See those fancy video cameras and that nice gentleman I was just speaking with? Uh, yeah. 
For the first time ever, BCW will be live streaming our event around the world on pay-per-view. So anyone who's not lucky enough to see Buzz in person can still watch him do his thing from the comfort of their homes for a small but fair fee. Isn't it great? Uh, yeah, it's great. Question, who is Buzz? Oh, <laughs> that's your new nickname. You know, because of all the social media buzz you're generating. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. Buzz? <laughs> it's all turning into chicken salad, my friend. Uh, yeah, speaking of making things not crappy, have you seen Cole? I feel like I should talk to him before our match tonight. Well, he's around here somewhere. And, oh, by the way, your match with him tonight is now Falls Count Anywhere. Thought you two could have some fun with all the extra space out here. <laughs> fun, yeah. You really have an That sounds good to me. Word. Fun. <laughs> See, move set, victory, entrance, video, podcast, tree, ability, skills. Where do I save? How do I save? Exit my career. Well, I'll worry all about this stuff myself, but thank you so much for watching or making it this far into the video. This is Heaven's Dark Phoenix, and we're playing WWE 2K19. Be sure to like, subscribe, and join us in our next video, which will probably come, be coming in weeks to come. Remember, I'll be giving out a Funko Pop uh, Ric Flair if you want some of that. Uh, I have an idea on how I want to put that out. Um, let's just go ahead and just have you comment... Uh, a favorite wrestler that's in this game uh, what I want to do is I want to pick uh, either six or eight uh, individuals who comment on this video um, we will take the wrestler that you uh, decided to have represent you put them in a battle royale and uh, whoever wins that battle royale will get the Funko Pop so um, how I'm going to pick the people, I have no idea just yet. Maybe I'll have my girlfriend pick or I don't know. Uh, I guess if you, uh, you know what, leave a good joke in the comments and leave your favorite wrestler or who you want to represent you in the Battle Royale. And if, if it makes me laugh or if it brings a smile to my face, then I'll add you uh, to that list and then we'll go from there. Or maybe we'll do a tournament. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But thank you so much for watching. This is Heaven Dark Phoenix, and you have yourself a good night.